Alright everybody, welcome back to another how to. It's the Red Line Rails here. Um, this how to, as of currently, on my list of how to's, this is the last one. Alright, so in this one, I'll be showing you how to do bulk asset replacement. Uh, let me go ahead and throw some switches in here. Just for the purposes of this video, is all it's for. throw one here this actually is not going to be a root of mine it looks like it could be but it is not all right so your switch stands are going to serve a purpose that's why I, had, I put them in here um, Let's get started. So, say you did a whole entire route and something there's something you don't like about it. Alright. So, say it's, as you can see, these generic switch stands they give you. They look European style to me. But we'll just say it's those. Alright. And just say you have a good amount. Let's just go with double digits. Say, you got 15 of these switch stands and you don't feel like it's not very productive to change every single one out there's a way to get around that same with the track say you have your roots done you don't feel like going back and replacing all that track there's an easy way as well to do that so I'm going to show you both those those normal ones that I end up changing is, probably, is normally the track and switch stands. I don't normally use this for anything else unless it's the texture. I can show you the texture as well. Alright, so we'll start off with the track. So what you want to do is you want to go up here to bulk asset update replace. You want to get your track that you currently have and then find something you'd like to change it to. Um, for me, I'm just gonna use one of my normal ones. I'm gonna use a JR track. And I'm gonna use a JR gray dirty weather. And all you do is drag it, hold on to it until you got it in this box. Click it in there. Alright. This is gonna say anywhere on the route. I'm not sure if it says anything else, but as far as I remember this is all it says. So you got your track that's here that you don't want. You don't like it for whatever reason. And you got your new one you want to change everything to. Once you have those two in the proper spots, you gotta have the one that you wanna update and where it says asset to update. The one you want in there needs to go where it says asset to update with. Once you have them both the way you want them and what you want in there, click begin. Once you click begin, the system's gonna automatically replace it throughout the whole entire route. That was pretty simple because, I mean, it's just a little area, but you get you get the point like if that was a big route it would replace the track on the whole entire route like I replaced I messed around with the uh, Emily Bay branch route and that's a completed route I completely changed all the track on that route it took a little bit but it changed it all alright next we'll do we'll do the switch stands alright so we're just gonna search for a switch stand here so it don't have to do it when it's up so we're gonna go with we're gonna go to Union Pacific one. All right, so same thing. Bulk asset update replace. For this, get the asset from the world. Switch lever. All right, and I'm gonna drag and drop my Union Pacific one that I chose that I'd like to change it to. And same thing. Click begin. It changed that one. It changed that one. All right, so that's done. You don't have to click on this every time, but it just it's just easier and next we're going to go to terrain uh, let's see too many too many terrains in this thing I got too many let's 
so let's go with I don't know. I'm trying to find something here. But we'll go with round ground rubble. Alright. It's the same thing, bulk acid update replace. Click get it. Gotta come up grid. Now I'm gonna use this one. Drop it in there. And this one is different because it comes up replace ground texture rotation and scale. It'll be whatever scale you have it set to. And whatever rotation as well. We'll rotate it. Let's rotate it to the west a little bit. Alright, we'll click begin and we're gonna go from having a grid to having some ground cover. Bam, there it is. Now we're doing like like I've done two western routes recently. This to me would be a perfect texture. Mix in a few other things and mix a few textures together and make it look good. But that's pretty much that as far as it goes for bulk asset replacements. As you saw it's pretty easy to do. It's not none of this is complicated as far as I've seen. The crossings is about the only complicated thing that I've come across. Uh, if you enjoyed this video give it a like, subscribe to the channel and uh, be sure to check my description box. There's a link in there for my website. I have currently have three routes in there that I built. Uh, all the assets are in there and I also I've spoken with individuals about creating custom content for me. Uh, once those are completed, those will be available on my website, and I'll leave a short video or a live video. I'm not sure which one yet. Um, talking about those assets and what they are, and where to go on the page to find them. Uh, like I said, if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Got any questions or you got any how-to videos you want me to? do a video on how, on how to do something in trains or trains a new era or I mean trains 2019 or trains a new era I mean leave a comment ask me uh, on my website you'll find my contact information you can always shoot me an email and we can talk and figure out like if there's any more how to's that need to be done uh, alright y'all have a good day and see you later